Hi, I'm Joni Hilton, your YouTube mom. I am going to give you today a wonderful gravy making secret from years and years past. Probably your great grandma did it this way and it works every time. And you know the difference between really good gravy and just okay gravy? Well, this is going to help you become one of those people who really knows how to make good gravy. Now, before I forget, you got to season it. So seasonings are important too. But here's how to have lump free gravy. This is something my mom taught me that her mom taught her and who knows how many generations it goes back. This is a little jar I keep in my cupboard and it's known as mom's gravy jar. <laughs> do I keep gravy in it? No, but what I do, what I use it for is I put a little bit of flour in there. That's probably about three tablespoons of flour. But put however much you want in order to thicken your gravy. And what you do is you take hot water, you pour it in the jar. Now you know as well as I do, if you just pour flour onto a hot skillet full of the drippings from a roast beef or from chicken, you're going to get lumps and little mini dumplings and it's going to be horrid, right? <laughs> Don't ever just add flour to hot fat. But if you add it to water, the same thing's going to happen, even hot water, unless you do it in a jar with a lid and you shake it. You shake it up until it looks like diluted glue, okay? <laughs> it's a thin, good, in fact, I'll just pour it back in here to show you. It's a, it's a good mixture, no lumps, it's smooth. And when you pour that into the hot fat and you stir it, it will just thicken up with no lumps. So now you know how to use a jar with a lid with flour and water to make really great gravy. I'm Joni Hilton. Go to my website, J-O-N-I Hilton. Check it out. I have all kinds of stuff on there, even books you can buy. <laughs> and tell your friends to subscribe and you subscribe. And we'll see you next time.